Good morning, good afternoon, good evening folks and welcome back to another video. Um, so I thought I'd already done this intro once but it turns out it went doolally and I lost my little intro. Um, never mind, I've still got all the other little bits. Um, so today, today I'm going to be doing a Chinese chicken with onions in a delicious oyster sauce. Um, yeah, absolutely outstanding. Um, I say I'm doing it today, I've already done it, but anyway, you wouldn't be any to the wiser um, if I didn't say so, but yeah, anyway, let's just get on with it, enough of me waffling. Okay folks, let's run through the ingredients for this, so I've got some chicken thigh fillets, I'm not going to use this entire pack, I'm only going to use a third, so three chicken fillets. Um, I've got an onion, a chilli, some spring onions there, some garlic cloves, I've got ground white pepper, light soy, dark soy, oyster sauce, rice wine and corn flour to use as a thickener and that is the ingredients and everything I need for this dish. So yeah, let me prep and we'll get cooking. So folks, as you can see, I have prepped, so I've diced the chicken into small bite-sized chunks. I've cut up the chili pepper, thinly sliced the garlic. I've cut the spring onions two ways, uh, into stems and into the leaves. And then what I've done is, with the red onion, I've cut them and then petaled them. So that, folks, along with all the ingredients, is everything I need. Now, let's get cooking. So folks, I've just put a little bit of oil in the pan. Now, this time I've gone for a little bit of garlic infused oil, olive oil. Now, the reason I've done that is you can use um, vegetable oil, sunflower oil, doesn't really matter. But I just want to give it a little bit of flavour. And there we go. Now what we're going to do is leave it, not even look at it. You can look at it while I crack on with something else. But yeah, I'll see you in a sec. Magnet fishing, fishing for fish. Da, 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 da. Buddy, I hear ya! So folks, I've flipped them all over. Now all I'm going to do is, again, just leave this one to two minutes. Don't look at it, don't touch it, and then I'm going to come back and I'm going to add the onions, the chilli, and cook it up and get all that glorious mojo going on. So I will see you in a sec. Right folks, I'm just going to give this a quick mix, it's been cooking now. And then what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go in with the red onions and the chilli. Now like I said, in the little intro, I have kettled these onions. Um, one, just to make it go further and save a little bit of money. Two, they're going to cook quicker. Three, they look pretty. So. We give these a mix and then I'm going to go in with the chilli. I've got to say, folks, this chilli is strong. So it's always the same. You can always put less and add more, but you can't take it back out. So that's going to be enough. Oh, yeah, that is strong. See, it's got straight on my nostril. So there we have it. I'm just going to give these a mix. I'm going to cook these down for two minutes before I come back and add the garlic and the spring onion. Magnet fish and fish and for fish. I hate this song with a lot of passion, anger, 
actually test if you're bulk body. So there we go. So folks, I'm now going to go in with the different sauces. So first up, I've got the dark soy sauce, a tablespoon's worth of that. Just going to get that in there. Next up, I'm going to put in the oyster sauce, lovely jubbly. Again, another tablespoon. And then, what I'm going in, I did show another soy sauce at the beginning, um, but I've actually already had one open. So I'm going to go in with the Heinz Premium Light Soy Sauce. Again, another tablespoon. Nice and easy, and I'm just going to give this a good mix up. It's really going to get in there, and then what you'll see is the colour of this dish just change straight away. Look at that. And then what I'm going to do is just keep mixing and then I'm going to go in with a teaspoon of sugar. So just, just a teaspoon of sugar just to balance out the salt within the soy sauce and the oyster sauce. And again, I'm just going to mix that and then I'm going to let that go for about 30 seconds. I'll come straight back and we're going to add a cup of wine. Right folks, I'm now going to add the cooking wine, the rice wine, and I'm just going to add four tablespoons. Um, don't worry if you can't take alcohol or you don't like alcohol you can just use four tablespoons worth of water it's um, really up to your choice and then I'm just going to give it a good mix and then all I'm going to do is I'm just going to cook down that liquid and then I'm going to add the rest of the, the pepper I'm going to add a little bit of cornstarch to thicken and then it'll be fantastic and ready to go. Now what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to add maybe a half teaspoon of white pepper. You don't want too much in here at all. You just want a little bit and then I'm going to give that another mix. Another stir. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add the a corn flour solution. Now what I've done is I've put some water into a cup. I've added the cornstarch, give it a little mix. And we're just going to put that in now. And then what that's going to do is it's going to thicken up. So any liquid that's in there is going to grab hold of the chicken, the onions and it's just going to cling to it and it's all extra flavour so what we're going to do is just keep stirring and then in about a minute or so I'm going to add the rest of the spring onions we'll cook them out and it's ready to serve but it's looking and smelling fantastic last little bit and all I'm going to do is just go in there with the spring onion. I'm going to give this a mix, we're going to let it cook down and then we're going to serve it and I'll tell you something I really cannot wait to get into this. Um, yeah, bring it on. Taste test time. Oh, and I will say, folks, I do apologise if I've offended anyone or hurt their ears by singing Buddy Biggs' theme song. But ever since he put it out there, it's been stuck in one's noggin. So, yeah, 
can't be helped that one I'm afraid. But I think folks, this is about done. Let's play it up and find out if it tastes as good as it looks. So folks, time to play it up and I'm not messing around. This time I'm just emptying it straight from the pan into my bowl. Oh, I'll tell you something folks, if you could have smelly vision and get this, wow. And there we have it folks, just look at that, absolutely amazing, I'll give you a closer look. So folks, what do you think of that then? I have to say looks amazing smells amazing let's hope it tastes amazing so let's go in for it there we have a nice piece of that chicken there with that lovely oyster soy sauce combo mix on it oh yeah oh Yeah. Oh, I love it. Right amount of heat, right amount of flavour. Chicken still lovely and moist, just falls apart in the mouth. Mmm. Oh, yeah. I would quite happily pay for this in a restaurant or a takeout. I've never seen any in a restaurant or takeout, but well, there we go. Save it a little bit. Oh, yeah, that is just superb. Absolutely superb. Really happy with it. Thank you for watching. Let me know, would you try it? Would you buy it? And actually, let me know, how much would you actually pay for it? Um, but yeah, until next time, thank you very much for joining. And adios.